Welcome to YouTube. My name is Chaz. Welcome back to another episode of Skyline Smoke Blends. And to by the title, today we are going to be smoking the herb known as Skulltap. This has been a very highly requested herb in my comments for many months now. And just to address the elephant in the room real quickly, I just want to apologize to all my subscribers and all my viewers for not making a video in the last 80 days or so. I've uh, been very busy uh, with school and extracurriculars outside of my, of, uh, in my social life and whatnot. Um, but as you guys can see, I've also been working on getting on, on a new setup. So I want to make these, I want to make nice quality videos. So yeah, this is the new setup, right? You just want to look real quick to see this fucking tapestry. I think it's so cool, man. Um, yeah, this is awesome. I'm really happy to be making videos here now. Um, this is a lot more comfortable. Um, and yeah, I apologize. And I, I want to start making videos again, uh, on a consistent schedule. And I actually have a lot of great ideas coming up for this year. And um, I, 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 I want to make sure that if I was taking a break from videos, I'd come back a lot better. And I hope you guys uh, like this setup, okay? So we're we're going off with a bang, right? We're starting off with a bang, skull cap, uh, really quickly. Just talk to you guys about skull cap. Uh, there are two main types of skull caps that people are familiar with. There's the American skull cap and there's the Chinese skull cap. Uh, the one that we're smoking today is like the North American uh, variant of skull cap. Uh, its its actual name is uh, Scutellaria later, lateri floria. I always butcher these names. Don't mind me. And you guys always ask me where I get where I get my herbs from. Uh, I actually got these. If you guys check it out right there, this is from Schmerbel Herbals. Um, they're a good company, and I like getting my herbs from them. I actually reached out to them a while back in December or November, and I wanted to see if maybe uh, we can do a part. I can do a partnership with them in the sense that I can get an affiliate code. Uh, for Schmerbel Herbals, that way then I can promote them to you guys. That way then you guys can get a discount, a discount on these herbs. I would get a commission, and then Schmerbel Herbals gets a, a, an increase in sales. I thought it'd be a win-win for everybody, but um, they actually never got back to me. Uh, but hey, you know they have an email, they have a website. So if you guys want, if you guys want to see me partner with them, let them know. At the end of the day, you know voices are heard. They'll get the ball rolling. All right, so. Are you guys excited? Because I'm excited. I've actually, I've never smoked Skull Cap before. I've never had it in a tea or anything. Today, you know, we're going to be doing the Holy Trinity. We've got the bong, the pipe, and we got the joint. We're going to start off with the joint. We're going to start off with the, with the, uh, the bong because, uh, you know, fun times, all right? So let's do it, guys. I'm going to take the bong with me. I'll, I'll talk to you more about the benefits, all right? So thank you. me <laughs> smoke burps wow <laughs> that was good that was good um <clears throat> it was really hot when i was first taking the hit but then it kind of settled in as i was taking it that was a nice trip um skull cap from what I, from what i've researched and what i've seen about the herb is it's been used in ancient cultures like most of these herbs, a lot of these herbs have been around for thousands of years, so they've always been used by ancient cultures, and it's always been used in traditional medicine. But this herb's really good for what I've seen is um, relaxation, sedation, helping people go to sleep, essentially. Um, apparently, th there's two compounds in it. One of them is called uh, bilocene, and apparently uh, when you smoke it, that compound enters your bloodstream, which then gives you the relaxation, okay? And automatically, as soon as I exhaled, I, I uh, automatically, I felt like a, um, almost like a calmness come over my body, over like, over my arms, you know. There's still one more hit in here, so I'm just going to take that one more hit. Excuse me. <laughs> that was good. That was a nice. That was a nice one. I'll put this down for a second. Very nice. Going next to the the Sherlock Holmes pipe. My favorite. They're all my favorite. I think everything's my favorite because it's, it's all a good time, you know. Oh. 
Okay. Uh, I think I missed some. You know, the thing was so interesting about this, this, um, pipe. This pipe is so long that sometimes it's kind of hard to get the right angle when I'm, um, lighting it, but that was a nice hit. You know, one thing, guys, I'm just saying, you know, I, I, uh, I really appreciate the support, you know, in the terms of not only the, the positivity and the comments that I receive, but, um, I really appreciate everybody that's been ordering, um, my blends from my website. Um, for those of you guys who don't know, um, I do have, um, smoke blends on my website, skylinesmokeblends.com, links in the description. Um, we have two different blends right now. One of them is, uh, the Skyline Special, which I have a video on it already, which is a herb comprised of wild dog, uh, Damiano and Blue Lotus. And that's like a, a herb that I would say that if people who smoke marijuana cannabis, they want to get, they want to smoke herbs that kind of give them like a, like a mild high, I would, uh, push them to that, to that kind of herb, to that blend. Um, I also have another blend, which is like a nighttime blend or a nighttime or a, like an anti-anxiety blend. It's like a very common blend. Um, we do, I do pre-rolls and I also sell them in packages and starting very soon, maybe by the time this video is up, we're also, now I'm also going to be doing, um, um, tea bags. So I'll, 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 it'll also be an option where you can buy tea bags from me. The tea bags also have the herb, whatever herb it is you guys want. Um, I'll also be doing that too, is right? So I just thought I should add that in there. So you guys know, right? All right. Going back to the second hit. That was a good one. That was a good one. Wow, that was nice. You know, I want to start making faster videos too, only because um, sometimes like my videos, they uh, you guys, those you guys watch them, they come out to like over twenty minutes long, twenty five minutes, and I'm like, man, like how how how, how does that even happen? You know, I didn't realize that I'd be talking so much. One thing I want to say too is um. I noticed I'd be getting a lot of comments. Not a lot of comments. Not a lot. But I've been getting some comments where um, people are, uh, I guess, bothered by the fact that I don't always uh, fully inhale um, when I smoke. And what I, what I mean sometimes, uh, I'll smoke a joint or something and I'll, and I'll just, I'll just exhale it. Um, you know, I do, I am, I am fully aware that um, when you smoke, like, for example, let's say I'm smoking the joint, I'm going to inhale it and then, Further inhale oxygen to really uh, take in the smoke, but I, I don't always do that. I don't always do that because, you know, I do what I want. You know, and if in the moment I, I don't feel like uh, fully inhaling, I don't. You know, but I haven't I haven't seen uh, a, a number of comments like that. Where some people are a little bothered by it, but hey, man, you know, I don't claim to be an expert. I always say I'm a herb enthusiast, and I just give you guys my opinion and the, the stuff that I've researched. And I let you guys know, and yeah, you know. Thank you. That was a bust. Excuse me. Yeah. Smoke burps, man. That was nice. Oof. Going on to my other favorite. I always say this is my favorite. Though. I, I love smoking joints, man. There's something so something so enjoyable just about being able to, you know, light this thing, put it into my mouth, smoke it, and I can be so free. I can walk around. Like, I, don't, I don't have to be so, like, you know, like, like, imagine carrying this thing around or imagine carrying the pipe. Like, that'd be kind of annoying. Right now in this moment, though, um, what I'm feeling is I'm feeling like I'm feeling a uh, lightheadedness. I'm feeling a sensation from my nose to my forehead and to my temples. I'm feeling like a, a sensation there. Um, like I said, lightheadedness, kind of like a little bit of a wavy feeling. I noticed that a lot of these herbs, you very, you feel similar. Like I would say like I'm feeling kind of similar to like wild lettuce. The wild lettuce, um, I'm saying this is kind of like a similar experience to that. That was nice. Whew. Excuse me. Whew. Wow, that was nice. Whew. 
One thing I should have brought, all right, if I was smart, I would have brought a ashtray if I was smart, but that's okay. Um, I'll figure that out next time. Don't worry. I'll clean this up later. I'm trying to give you guys like an idea of what the flavor is um but a lot of these herbs um they don't have a distinct flavor um in the sense that i think the more you smoke different herbs the more you realize how similar these herbs actually taste okay like for example i think if you put wild lettuce skull cap and I don't know, catnip and like, maybe like, I don't know, Damiana. I'm not, I, I, if I had to do a blind, I was blindfolded, I had to smoke every single one. I don't think I'd be able to tell you which one was with based on the flavor. Maybe based on feeling, I can tell you which one's with, but based purely on flavor and how it tastes, I don't think I'd be able to tell you. So I hope that gives you an idea of how, I know it doesn't give you an idea of what the flavor is, but uh, just for the cop I answer, I'll say it tastes earthy. Excuse me. Wow, man. I love thick smoke, man. Holy shit, dude. Wow. One experience. Guy, I can't believe it. 818 subscribers? That is ridiculous. Considering the fact that my last video, my last video was I was I was right I was right under 500. Now, you know, a couple months later, and look, man, we're almost at a thousand subscribers, man. The road to monetization. That's what it is, man. The road to monetization. <laughs> um, on a serious note, though, man, um, like I said, you know, to me, it's insane that over 800 people are mildly interested in this content. Um, not that it's cool or anything. I'm just like, wow, like, that's just insane to me because, you know, I have uh, more subscribers on this YouTube channel than I do followers on Instagram, my personal page, you know, so it's just, um, interesting, you know, to say the least. Oh, ash went in my rug, but that's fine. <clears throat> Excuse me. But yeah, guys, my goal is, um, now I want, I want to, um, I actually found, um, interesting story. I actually found my, my old, um, a few years ago, like a couple years ago, uh, 2018, 2018 was when I started my, my journey with herbs. I bought a book and I actually found that book recently, only a couple weeks ago. And I haven't, looked, I haven't looked through the book in like a year and a half, maybe two years or something. Um, and I was like reading through it. I'm like, wow, this is really good, really good stuff. And I'm actually going to start doing maybe like recipes of the week. Um, or just pulling stuff from the book and like reviewing it from you, from you guys. Like the book had different recipes and different blends that it says you should try. And I'm going to try those blends and see if whatever these, whatever the, it's claiming to do, I'll let you guys know. Pretty much. Like that, I hope people don't like when I do stuff like that because they say I'm not inhaling it. But um, I don't care, man. Like, I don't know. I enjoy it, you know? Um, wow. I actually like Skullcap. I actually like this better than Wild Lettuce, if I'm being honest. Um, you really do feel a relaxation, um, a lightheadedness, and like a, a slowness. I always say that, um, because I am on camera and because I am recording a video, um, I'm always going to stay more cognizant, regardless of whatever I'm smoking. Because I am recording a video. I think that if I was just smoking this, like watching TV or just chilling with my friends, I would, I, I, I think I'd be able to feel myself drift. Drift, you know? If that makes sense. Um, drift more. You know, like I said, because when I'm playing a video, I, I know I have to be a little bit more conscientious because uh, I have to take in what I'm feeling and try to put it in words, you know? Wow, man. But nothing worse than a smoke gets in my eye. Oh, 
couple of them came out on camera said they didn't. I might cry. Wow. Yeah, so you know, I I I don't I don't usually do like um like ratings. Like I'm like, oh oh that was four out of five, that was eight out of ten. I don't usually do that, but um I think it might. I mean, right now I'm, I'm feeling like, yeah, you know what? This is uh, I feel like rating this. I give it an eight. I give it an eight. You might ask me yourself, well, what's a ten or what's a one? I couldn't tell you. But right now in this moment, I feel like it's an eight, you know? This is a good herb. Um you guys should definitely try it. I could definitely see this um being a nighttime herb. If you guys want a recommendation, I would recommend perhaps mixing this with like a chamomile or mixing this with a lavender um, for extra relaxation, extra anti-anxiety, extra sedation, extra calmness. Um, I would recommend that. Um, but yeah, that, I feel good. And um, I feel okay stopping the video here. <laughs> so uh, guys, once again... Thank you so much for the support. Thank you for watching my videos. Just thank you for everything. Because um, like I said, without you guys, there's no videos. Um, like I said, we're, I'm going to give my word to you guys that I will be putting videos out on a more consistent basis. And yeah. And guys, I, I'm just thinking about starting a TikTok and um, doing videos like this in a, in a different fashion. I know TikTok is a different platform. But let me know what you guys think about that. Um, but once again, guys, thank you so much. Uh, once again, this is Chaz from Skyline Smoke Blend signing out. Peace.